हरे कृष्णा क्वेश्चन फॉर मनोज अग्रवाल प्रभु आर फॉरेन ब्रीड्स ऑफ काउस नॉट गोमाता आर दे फॉर राक्षस दैट्स वॉट आई हर्ड सम स्पिरिचुअल टीचर से दे से दैट वी शुड ब्रीड एंड ड्रिंक मिल्क ओनली फ्रॉम द इंडियन ब्रेड काउस नॉट फ्रॉम फॉरन ब्रेड काउस एंड बट आई नो दैट एज फार एज एन यू प्रभुपाद वुड ड्रिंक मिल्क फ्रॉम वॉट एवर सोर्स इज अवेलेबल आंसर in every field of service there will be levels of proficiency which can be achieved and one doesn't have to mandate one particular standard as the absolute so for example when we do kirtan is it that somebody who is absolutely perfect in playing rudanga should only play rudanga no as long as one knows some basic steps of playing rudanga surely one can play rudanga so uh, but if there is a masterly rudanga player why not welcome that person and that person can actually do much more justice to uh, the kirtan but uh, we are not required to stop playing rudanga just because we don't we haven't mastered that level of proficiency in doing kirtans and uh, yeah and it may not be possible also for everyone to have that level of proficiency so is it desirable yes it's desirable is it essential no it's not essential so similar so this can apply to every service and this applies also to the service of uh, say goraksha so yes you know, there is interbreeding which can often lead to contamination of qualities so in tra among traditional uh, carers of cows the uh, hybrid cows or the cows of foreign breeds are considered contaminated and uh, now uh, from the biological point of view there may not be much difference but we also understand there is the element of consciousness and for any soul to be born in india it is special so for a soul to be born in india even in the cow's body is special and now we are are saying special in the spiritual sense not necessarily a spiritual sense but in the sense that there is the particular atmosphere which leads to the particular kind of qualities biological as well as others which manifest in people so now there are of course the whole principle of cow being sacred we cannot really reduce it to scientific level it is subtle so certainly uh, we can and should give great uh, high regard to uh, the cows which are of indian breed but does that mean that we should stop breeding or drinking all other cows uh, no not at all the principle of go seva is a universal principle and is it that devotees in america where they cannot have indian bred cows that they are not allowed to do go seva at all and obviously not they can do go seva and they should do go seva if it's possible and now the milk there will also have some nutritional benefits and uh, now is it that the milk which is coming only from indian breed cows has a higher nutritional value well that uh, uh, to convince uh, to scientifically minded people we may have to do much more research and talk about nutritional value and talk about scientific explanations so till then till we are able to give a rational explanation we don't and unless we get a, unless we have a clear uh, precedent from shastra which we don't have uh, so we don't have to make this a mandatory issue so shila prabhupad was eminently pragmatic in his practice and sharing of krishna consciousness there are certain principles which have to be followed and so one principle for example is go seva so he encourages that for devotees everywhere so now uh, if it is possible for devotees to breed indian cows and to get milk from those cows that is good uh, is it desirable yes it is definitely desirable is it essential definitely it is not essential you no know, we should do go seva in whatever way we can and we should drink milk whatever milk is available certainly we should avoid drinking milk Or as a certainly minimize milk, minimize drinking milk that has come from violence to cows. So if we know in our locality some traditional farmers who take care of cows and don't uh, extract milk from them to the point that the cows get exhausted or 
cows bleed or whatever so basically if the cows are taken care of then those uh, places we should support even if it means a little bit exp more expense that is okay uh, that is that expense is actually going for go seva so now what kind of se go seva we can do that will vary depending on our time place circumstance so if somebody can they then they should do breeding of indian cows but trying to reduce go seva to only seva of cows which are of indian breed that is uh, not shastric and that is not really according to the example that shri prabhupada said is it desirable it is definitely but is it essential no thank you right